Hi, I want to show you how to go ahead and evaluate an each expression. So, let's go and say I have a simple each expression. Now, meaning it's an expression, an expression is a set of uh, letters, um, or symbols, or we really like to call them, or also numbers. Notice there is no equation sign, so it's not an equation, we're not solving. What we're going to do is we're going to evaluate. Now, the difference for evaluating and simplify is evaluate, we're going to evaluate for actually a set of terms, kind of like some constraints or definitions. So, let's go and say, I want to evaluate when x equals 3, y equals a negative 2, and let's say p equals 1 half. So, what I'm going to do when I want to go ahead and evaluate an expression, I'm going to say, all right, well, and here's my expression. I know now, since I put in uh, these definitions for what the value should be, I know that x now equals 3. So, I'm going to plug in a 3 in for the x. I plug in a negative 2 for the y and a 1 half for the p. The reason why I put parentheses on there is therefore we know that each one of these values is going in for, into to represent each one of these symbols or letters as they are. So now I'm going to go ahead and use my order of operations. I'm going to do my multiplication first from left to right. So I have 2 times 3 which becomes a 6 plus a negative 2 times 1 half is going to become a negative 1 and then 6 plus a negative 1 becomes a 5. And that is how you would simplify a expression. I'm sorry, that's how you evaluate an expression.